Hello and welcome to Seven Rocks. Uh, this video is going to be about one rock that I found at Mountain Bike Trail when I went with my son a couple weeks ago. That video. Uh, it's a little different. The, the black marked lines you see in it, I thought they were cracks. And so I looked at them under magnifying glass. This actually looks like a black paint. And it is some type of black paint. And not only is the black lines painted but the whole rock appears to have the texture of paint and um so i had it for that day and then the next day and i'm looking at it and the whole thing turned the color of the black marks for like a day and i was like okay maybe i spilled oil on it or something like that and messed it up and i just put it in dirt and covered it up and said okay maybe I can absorb something off get some of the oil or something off and it'll be fine but the next day was back to showing images again um, I've showed it to a person I know that kind of sees some of the same things I do in a rock and I'm not going to say what I see on it or anything like that because I don't want to influence your vision but I do see images on this rock I have a few rocks that are I guess you'd say paint it or you know have images on it like this most rocks that I find that you see faces or places in they don't look like they're painted they just have faces or places that appear and change it's hard to get the rock into focus and if it appears that an image changes from the time I turn it to another time I show you another side, it did. The image usually changes, you know, like every day or every other day, but they repeat. I'm going to try to give you a few views of the rock. I don't know if there's a right side up or an upside down. It depends on what you see. And like I said, as I turn it, you might think you saw something. It's hard for it to focus in. You might think you saw something one time and then it changes to something else. But this is more like the type of things I find. You know, I, I tried to show a bunch of regular rocks or stuff on, I guess, in all the videos. And I was kind of just skirting by, I guess, what I really wanted to show. Watch the thing, which are the things like this that I find. And I find just as much like this as I do regular rocks. That's why I... I really don't know if I'm the rock hound or the rock houndy. I, I don't know. But again, I'll turn it. I don't know if you're getting the same images every time I turn it. And if you're not, your eyes aren't playing tricks on you. They change. As far as my beliefs, I believe in everything, but I'm going to tell you, I'm old school. If I'm having a problem, I'll thank God for Jesus every day. Um, but, you know, I do respect the, you know, the, the dimensional aspects of things that people talk about, frequencies. And I just think sometimes we get on the same frequency as, as the images that the beings that were here left for us and we can see sometimes I look at these rocks as like the video recorders and they do have a story to tell if we can get on the same frequency with them I'm 
just let the rocks be for itself. You're probably seeing a different image on this side than you saw before. If anybody's had, anybody has any ideas about the what's and the why's, um, let me know. But this is more of a common type rock for me to find. Again, not the ones that appear to be painted with the changing paint, but just rocks in general tend to all have uh, either faces or places that I have a saying that I have for my, you know, that I came up for what I see. If you look at the faces long enough, they tend to become like a place. The faces tend to change to geography in certain rocks. Not all rocks. Again, I'm just using different angles and turning the rock all different ways I don't you know I don't know what people see if they see some people look at this and say what the heck is he talking about um, but I guess one of the real reasons I even came on YouTube is to primarily sh share things like this wow You know, I was kind of glad in a way that I did get into the rocks later. So I know, I, of course, okay, I can't nap. I can't do a lot of these things that the guys that are really good at, you know, rock working and things do. So it adds more credibility to if I find something. And believe me, I definitely can't paint. <laughs> Not like this. I mean, I can draw a little bit sometimes. I can draw the images of what I see. Sometimes, and that's not all the time. You know, if I get a certain, you know, so I'm just. Well, anyway, I can draw sometimes images I see. But that's pretty much it. Um, like I say, this feels painted. Doesn't really get cold. It's always warm. And like I say, I, I kind of got sooner than later to, I guess, why I really came on YouTube because, you know, like I say, most of the rocks I pick up, they become like videos, you know, and it's not just the image that you see, it's actual movement. And to some, this might sound odd, to some... It might not. <sighs> anyway, thank you for looking. Um, thank you.